Shalom. It is about 4, 17 a.m. Praise you, Father. You are good. Your grace and your mercy endures forever and ever is your faithfulness. Praise you, Father. You are good. Your grace and your mercy endures forever and ever is your faithfulness. It's time to arise. It's time to be mentally renovated. Time to have the mind renewed. Yes, Yahoo, Isaiah 60. Yes, Yahoo, 60. Arise, shine, Jerusalem. For your light has come. The glory of Yahweh has risen over you. For although darkness covers the earth and thick darkness the peoples, on you Yahweh will rise. Over you will be seen his glory. Nations will go towards your light and kings towards your shining splendor. Raise your eyes and look around. They are all assembling themselves and coming to you. Raise your eyes and look around. Open your eyes. Look around. Your sons are coming from afar off. Your daughters are being carried on the nurse's hips. Then you will see and be radiant. Your heart will throb and swell with delight. For the riches of the seas will be brought to you. The wealth of... Mm. Your sons are coming from afar off. Your daughters being carried on their nurse's hips. Then you will see and be radiant. Your heart will throb and swell with delight. For the riches of the seas will be brought to you. The wealth of the nations will come to you. Caravans and car caravans of caramels will cover your land. Young camels from Midian and Ephah. All of them coming from Shiva, bringing gold and frankincense and proclaiming the praise of Yahweh. All the flocks of Kedar will be gathered for you. The rams will be at your service. They will not come up and be received on my altar. They will come up and be received on my altar as I glorify the house of my glory. As he glorifies the house of his glory, he will bring glory to the house that brings him glory. Who are these flying like along with the clouds? Like doves to their devocates. The coastlands are putting their, their hope in me. With Tarsus ships in the, in the lead. To bring your children from far away. And with them their silver and gold. For the sake of Yahweh your God. The Holy One of Israel who glorifies you. Hallelujah. Foreigners will we build your walls. Their kings will be at your service. For in my anger I struck you. I know about this. For in my anger, I struck you. But in my mercy, I pity you. Your gates will always be open. They will not be shut day or by night. So that people can bring you wealth of the nations. With their kings led in procession. For the nation or kingdom that does not serve you will perish. Yes, then those nations will be utterly destroyed. The glory of Lebanon will be brought to you. Cypress together with elm trees and larches to beautify the side of my sanctuary. I will glorify the place that I stand, says Yahweh. Let him stand in you so he can glorify you. I will glorify the place that I stand. The children of your oppressors will come and bow before you. All who despise you will fall at your feet, calling you the city of Yahweh, Zion, the Holy One of Israel. In the past, you were abandoned and hated. So that no one would even pass through you. But now, I will make you the pride of ages. Hallelujah. A joy of many generations. You will drink the milk of nations. You will nurse a royal breast. And know that I, Yahweh, am your savior, your redeemer, the mighty one of Jacob. For bronze, I will bring you gold. For iron, I will bring you silver. For bronze in place of wood and iron in place of stones, I will make Shalom your governor. And righteousness your taskmaster. Violence will no longer be heard in your land. Desolation and destruction within your borders. Instead, you will call your walls salvation and your gates praise. No more will the sun be your light by day, nor will moonlight shine on you. Instead, Yahweh will be your light forever and your God will be your glory. No longer will your sun go down. Your moon will no longer wane for Yahweh will be your light forever. Your days of mourning will end. All your people will be righteous. Is that he? 
They will inherit the land forever. They will be a branch I planted, my handiwork in which I take pride. The smallest will grow into a thousand. The weakest will become a mighty nation. I, Yahweh, when the right time comes, will quickly bring it about. Yes, Yahoo, 61, prophecy about Yeshua. The spirit of Yahweh is upon me because Yahweh has anointed me to announce good news to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted. To proclaim freedom for the captives, to let out into the mm, to let out into the light those bound in the dark, to let out into the light those bound in the dark, to proclaim the year of Yahweh, to proclaim the year of favor of Yahweh and the day of vengeance of our God, to comfort all those who mourn. Yes, provide for those in Zion who mourn, and give them garlands instead of ashes, the oil of gladness instead of mourning. The year of Yahweh. It's time to arise and shine for Yahweh. His glory, His spirit is here. It's coming. Therefore, repent for the kingdom of heaven is near, right at the door. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.